What's up my Pungios, Andy with Andy Vlogs, excited to share with you guys this content here. As the title suggests, we're going to be going over the commuter case by the folks at Otter for your Samsung Galaxy S22 Ultra. Now the Ultra just came out recently and I wanted to get my hands on a case that uh, fit my lifestyle. I wanted to get it from a company that is known for shockproof military grade protection here, which uh, this does survive three times as many of those um, drops as the standard, which is really nice. So that gives me comfort here that in the event that I drop it, my wife drops it, my kids drop it, that the likelihood is going to be, you know, reduced significantly. With that said, this is not a sponsored video. The folks at Otter did not reach out to me, nor did I uh, get this for free from them. Uh, they, I did purchase this with my own money, so you guys know where my bias is. But down below in the links in the description will be the product pricing availability for this product, as well as uh, some of the other products that we go over here today. With that said, let's go ahead and uh, take a look at it and see if it's any better than the Mohs leather here that I'm currently sporting. This Mohs leather case has a really sleek design, polycarbonate, protecting material on the inside to provide pr protection against drops. I don't know about the military grade though, that's kind of interesting. Let's go and take a look at the commuter and see what uh, what it has to offer. What's nice here is they're definitely uh, eco-friendly, they use 100% recycled material and the case has significantly less, like 30% less than your average, uh, you know, inside the box kind of just crap and filth. Uh, I mean, there's nothing in here, there's no protective screen or plastic or anything, that's it. This is a polycarbonate rubberized uh, silicone material. Polycarbonate is this backside shell. Uh, the rubberized material is the grip around here that actually comes off. So uh, before you install it here, you're going to want to put the silicone on first and then place it uh, in this plastic polycarbonate material. The tooling here is good and nice. Uh, the theory here is that this is supposed to provide some extra protection against falls. Um, you guys will be the one to decide. Um, there's no other you know, special magnets or materials on the inside it's just these two different materials that you're looking at with that said let's go ahead and uh, peel off the leather case from Moe's which is a little bit more uh, stressful to push out Ugh, it's so difficult let's go ahead and put in the uh, silicone first really straightforward really easy placing it in there you can see that the the corners kind of rise and bump up to provide extra protection there you've got the grip here on the back side um, to be able to place the now plasticky part from the silicone, uh, pretty straightforward to be able to place it in there, put in the grooves and it kind of snaps together in those grooves. Now when putting this thing together, make sure you get this little flap down because I, I couldn't get it to uh, fit right when I'm putting the polycarbonate piece on. But you want to peel that off first and then it'll be able to grab onto it. You can kind of feel it click into place in each of these grooves. There's like a, a little inset part. Um, and then it allows you to kind of just grab right on top of it um, Just like that and then you can place this back where it, where it needs to be Alrighty, well there it is you can see here that it's a tool so it gives you some uh, e Extra room here on the edges you got a forehead and chin that that kind of pushes out uh, By about a 32nd of an inch to give you nice clearance here so that you're not touching uh, the screen itself it does have enough room to put a screen protector, which is nice, which I have. You guys can see down below in the links in the description there for that. Uh, buttons are nice and rubbery and clicky. They press just nice. There's a nice rubber grip here on the edges as well on the back. So in the event that you're holding it, you know, you're, you're doing your um, vertical video, which I'm adamantly against. You can still grip it and it uh, won't slick from your hand. On the back side here, you do have, do have a divot for the camera bump, which is nice. You've got the otter box and you've got the different places where it kind of connects and gives you that protection. On the back side here, this uh, polycarbonate material is very, very strong and thick, which I like. And then uh, they did opt into this full square groove instead of having something come up here, um, which I think is kind of interesting. They had that on the other OtterBox cases. Lastly here, I want to show you that this is compatible with uh, wireless charging. I've got this 20,000 milliamp battery, which is nice. It's uh, mainly MagSafe and does have some IO here to be able to plug directly into it. However, if you wanted to have a wireless option, you could. You can just place it right on top and the uh, case allows it to go right through and you can charge. You can even uh, fast charge. It's pretty good. Uh, I need to charge this phone. At the time of this video here, I got it for $39.99. It's a little bit expensive here, but I do believe uh, in different colors, you can actually get it for about $6 cheaper. Uh, with that said, guys, um, links are down below in the description here. This is a really, really nice case. And I think, uh, you know, despite just jumping out there and getting, 
your run-of-the-mill silicone or polycarbonate case consider this one otter has been known to have really really strong protective cases and uh, this one is one among them but it won't break the bank they're usually like in the $60 $70 range with that said guys if you like this content here and want to check out any of the uh, you know products that we've gone over the links are down below in the description those are affiliate links and they do help out not a sponsored video I didn't get this for free. I did spend my money on it. With that said, guys, uh, appreciate you guys' support and watching to the end. Hit that subscribe button and like. We'll catch you on the next one.